With over 41,000 students, the University of South Florida in Tampa is a global research university dedicated to student success. The Department of Physics is a foundational cornerstone of the School of Natural Sciences and Mathematics, which is in the largest college in the university, the College of Arts and Sciences. Our mission is to excel in the education of our graduate and undergraduate students and to be innovative and impactful in research at the frontiers of scientific knowledge. We are a 21st century physics department generating new scientific knowledge and graduating students who will improve the human condition. The department has seen exponential growth in its research activity. In particular, our active research grants have now increased to $16 million in 2013. Our young faculty members have received four NSF career awards in just the past five years since 2009. The department has been housed in a new seven-story interdisciplinary science building since the fall of 2011. This building has state-of-the-art facilities both for teaching as well as for research. A particular area in which we have international expertise is in the area of thermoelectric materials which are used for alternative energy applications. My laboratory focuses on energy-related technologies, new materials and new ways of making materials in order to discover new, not only new materials, but new approaches as to how to make materials of technological interest. We've recently patented a new synthetic approach. We, we coined the kinetically controlled thermal decomposition, whereby we can make metastable materials that not only have not been synthesized before, but we are actually synthesizing them in single crystal form. Research in theoretical and computational materials physics spans the range from inorganic functional materials to soft condensed matter. Some of our achievements include development of very accurate atomistic models to simulate functional materials. In particular, we have developed the first computational model that allows to simulate the change in temperature during solid state refrigeration cycle directly. In the future, we are looking to discover new materials for efficient energy harvesting, conversion and conservation, as well as new materials for nanoscale, ultra-fast electronics and next generation memory technology. A particular area of great interest in our department is that of interdisciplinary research in atomic molecular and optical physics, which includes both optics and bioimaging. The focus of USF research into optical physics is to study fundamental properties of light and to develop cutting edge tools and applications for probing a variety of systems. Digital holography is an emerging technology for capturing 3D profiles of optical fields. Cellular structures can be profiled with nanometer precision to monitor, for example, chromosome volume change during laser microsurgery. As a new general imaging principle, uh, digital holography opens up a host of new applications and technologies for imaging and studying tiniest nano and microstructures to astronomical objects of grandest scales. One of the interesting projects that is going on in biophysics involves looking at amyloid fibro formation. The long-term goal is to try to see whether concepts of phase transition in physics are applicable to the growth of protein fibrils, which is very important for applications in Alzheimer's disease and in type 2 diabetes. These areas are the basis for a doctoral program in applied physics. The doctoral program combines the fundamental rigor of a traditional physics education in the foundations of physics with research possibilities in optical physics, biophysics, and materials physics. Students have an excellent opportunity to participate in cutting-edge research, not only to underline fundamental science, but also to apply fundamental concepts towards more technological issues. This is extremely beneficial for our students when they seek employment. USF physics program provides me with valuable experience, knowledge, and skills necessary for the next stage of my career. Part of the PhD program, we have industrial practicum course that provides you with real-life experience working in the company. Because of that, I was able to find that uh, job and uh, where I'm currently working. Our graduate students in the applied physics degree program are not only involved in academic research in the lab, but they're also involved in national and international collaborations. This spring I'll be traveling to Slovakia to 
spend a month as a uh, guest researcher at the Slovak Institute of Experimental Physics. So the experience of having international collaborators is one that's um, very common among the graduate physics students at USF. Our graduate students are also very much a fabric of the Department of Physics. Last year, several of us in the physics department decided to form a student organization focused on student success. We involve ourselves in orientation, develop student groups, and provide resources for new students. Three of our doctoral students were selected to attend the 62nd Physics Nobel Laureates meeting in Lindau, Germany in the summer of 2012. Undergraduate research is a required component of the degree program in our department. In 2009, the Department of Physics received a three-year award from the National Science Foundation to establish an REU site in applied physics in our department. The research experience for undergraduates was then reviewed by the National Science Foundation and renewed for another three years and continues to bring 10 to 12 undergraduates on an annual basis. These are times of intellectual excitement and professional and personal growth for our faculty, staff, and students. I'm particularly excited about the contributions that our students could make towards changing the future of science and technology.